obituaries of all the presidents of the United States. Before we proceed, please subscribe to our channel to support us. George Washington He was born in February 1732 and he died in December 1799. His age was 67 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was acute bacterial epiglottitis. He was an American founding father, politician, military officer and farmer. He served as the first president of the United States. John Adams He was born in October 1735 and he died in July 1826. His age was 90 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was heart failure. He was an American statesman, attorney, diplomat, writer and founding father. He was a leader of American Revolution that achieved independence from Great Britain. He served as the second president of the United States. Thomas Jefferson He was born in April 1743 and he died in July 1926. His age was 83 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was kidney infection and pneumonia. He was an American statesman, planter, diplomat, lawyer, architect, philosopher and founding father. He served as the third president of the United States and he was also the author of Declaration of Independence. James Madison He was born in March 1751 and he died in June 1836. His age was 85 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was heart failure. He was an American statesman, diplomat and founding father. He is also considered as the father of constitution. He served as the fourth president of the United States. James Monroe He was born in April 1758 and he died in July 1831. His age was 73 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was tuberculosis and heart failure. He was an American statesman, lawyer and founding father. He was known for Monroe Doctrine. He was the fifth President of the United States. John Quincy Adams He was born in July 1767 and he died in February 1848. His age was 80 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was stroke. He was an American statesman, politician, diplomat, lawyer and diarist. He was also an advocate of abolition. He served as the sixth president of the United States. Andrew Jackson He was born in March 1767 and he died in June 1845. His age was 78 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was chronic dropsy and heart failure. He was an American lawyer, planter, general and statesman. He was also the founder of Democratic Party. He served as the seventh president of the United States. Martin Van Buren He was born in December 1782 and he died in July 1862. His age was 79 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was asthma and heart failure. He was an American lawyer, diplomat and statesman. He was also the co-founder of Democratic Party and he served as 8th President of the United States. William Henry Harrison He was born in February 1773 and he died in April 1841. His age was 68 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was pneumonia and fever. He was an American military officer and politician. His presidency was the shortest lasting just 31 days. He served as the ninth president of the United States. John Tyler He was born in March 1790 and he died in January 1862. His age was 71 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was stroke. He was an American politician and lawyer. He was the first vice president to ascend to the presidency due to death and he served as the 10th President of the United States. 
James K. Pope. He was born in November 1795 and he died in June 1849. His age was 53 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was cholera. He was an American politician. He was known for expanding the United States territory and he served as the 11th President of the United States. Zachary Taylor. He was born in November 1784 and he died in July 1850. His age was 65 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was gastroenteritis. He was an American military leader and politician. He was also a hero of Mexican-American War and he served as the 12th President of the United States. Millard Fillmore. He was born in January 1800 and he died in March 1874. His age was 74 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was stroke. He was an American politician and lawyer. He is known for signing the Compromise of 1850. He served as the 13th President of the United States. Franklin Pierce he was born in November 1804 and he died in October 1869. His age was 64 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was cirrhosis of the liver. He was an American politician and lawyer. His presidency saw increasing tensions leading to civil war and he served as 14th President of the United States. James Buchanan. He was born in April 1791 and he died in June 1868. His age was 77 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was respiratory failure. He was an American politician and lawyer and he was known for his inability to prevent the succession of the southern states. He served as the 15th President of the United States. Abraham Lincoln. He was born in February 1809 and he died in April 1865. His age was 56 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was assassination. He was an American lawyer, politician and statesman. He was known for leading the country during the Civil War and abolitioning slavery. He served as the 16th President of the United States. Andrew Johnson. He was born in December 1808 and he died in July 1875. His age was 66 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was stroke. He was an American politician who succeeded Abraham Lincoln after his assassination and he served as the 17th President of the United States. Ulysses S. Grant. He was born in April 1822 and he died in July 1885. His age was 63 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was throat cancer. He was an American military officer and politician. He was a commanding general during the American Civil War and he served as 18th President of the United States. Rutherford B. Hayes he was born in October 1822 and he died in January 1893. His age was 70 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was heart attack. He was an American politician and lawyer. He was known for ending the Reconstruction era and he served as the 19th President of the United States. James A. Garfield he was born in November 1831 and he died in September 1881. His age was 49 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was assassination. He was an American politician and lawyer and he was assassinated shortly after taking office. He served as the 20th President of the United States. Chester A. Arthur he was born in October 1829 and he died in November 1886. His age was 57 at the time of his death and the reason for his death 
was cerebral hemorrhage. He was an American politician and lawyer, and he was known for his advocacy of civil service reforms. He served as the 21st President of the United States. Grover Cleveland He was born in March 1837, and he died in June 1938. His age was 71 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was heart attack. He was an American politician and lawyer, and he was known for his fiscal conservatism and vetoes. He served as the 22nd and 24th President of the United States. Benjamin Harrison He was born in August 1833, and he died in March 1901. His age was 67 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was pneumonia. He was an American politician and lawyer. He was known for his tariffs and foreign policy initiatives. He served as the 23rd President of the United States. William McKinley He was born in January 1843, and he died in September 1901. His age was 58 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was assassination. He was an American politician and lawyer, and he served as the 25th President of the United States. Theodore Roosevelt He was born in October 1858, and he died in January 1919. His age was 60 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was blood clot in his lungs. He was an American politician, soldier, conservationist, historian, naturalist, explorer, and writer. He was known for his progressive reforms and conservation efforts. He served as the 26th President of the United States. William Howard Taft He was born in September 1857, and he died in March 1930. His age was 72 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was heart disease. He was an American politician and jurist. He served as the 27th President of the United States and later 10th Chief Justice of the United States. Woodrow Wilson He was born in December 1856, and he died in February 1924. His age was 67 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was stroke. He was an American politician and academic. He was known for leading the country during the First World War and advocating for the League of Nations. He served as the 28th President of the United States. Warren G. Harding He was born in November 1865, and he died in August 1923. His age was 57 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was heart attack. He was an American politician and journalist. He is remembered for the scandals of his administration, and he served as the 29th President of the United States. Calvin Coolidge He was born in July 1872, and he died in January 1933. His age was 60 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was heart attack. He was an American attorney and politician. He was known for his laissez-faire approach to governance. He served as the 30th President of the United States. Herbert Hoover He was born in August 1874, and he died in October 1964. His age was 90 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was internal hemorrhage. He was an American politician and mining engineer. His presidency saw the onset of the Great Depression. He served as the 31st President of the United States. Franklin D. Roosevelt He was born in January 1882, and he died in April 1945. His age was 63 at the time of his death, and the reason for his death was cerebral hemorrhage. He was an American politician, known for his New Deal's policies and leadership during the Second World War, and he served 
as the 32nd President of the United States. Harry S. Truman He was born in May 1884 and he died in December 1972. His age was 88 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was multiple organ failure. He was an American politician and farmer. He was known for Truman Doctrine and the decision to use atomic bombs during the Second World War. He served as the 33rd President of the United States. Dwight D. Eisenhower He was born in October 1890 and he died in March 1969. His age was 78 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was congestive heart failure. He was an American military general and politician. He was also commanding general during the Second World War and he served as 34th President of the United States. John F. Kennedy He was born in May 1917 and he died in November 1963. His age was 46 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was assassination. He was an American politician and naval officer. He is remembered for his charisma, the Cuban Missile Crisis, and his assassination. He served as the 35th President of the United States. Lyndon B. Johnson He was born in August 1908 and he died in January 1973. His age was 64 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was heart attack. He was an American politician and teacher. He was known for his great society programs and the escalation of the Vietnam War. He served as 36th President of the United States. Richard Nixon He was born in January 1913 and he died in April 1994. His age was 81 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was true. He was an American politician and lawyer. He was known for his foreign policy achievements and resignation aimed the Watergate scandal. He served as the 37th President of the United States. Gerald Ford He was born in July 1913 and he died in December 2006. His age was 93 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was cardiovascular disease. He was an American politician and lawyer and he served as 38th President of the United States. Ronald Reagan He was born in February 1911 and he died in June 2004. His age was 93 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was Alzheimer's disease and pneumonia. He was an American politician and actor. He served as the 48th President of the United States. George H. W. Bush He was born in June 1924 and he died in November 2018. His age was 94 at the time of his death and the reason for his death was Parkinson's disease. He was an American politician, diplomat, and businessman. He was known for his foreign policy achievements, including the Gulf War. He served as the 41st President of the United States. Thanks for watching the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Have a nice day.